Hey, hello friend, and welcome back once again to another episode of Decisive Campaigns, made possible by Patreon supporter Pumnorau. Today we'll continue again up north, even though I already did that once before. All this in intercept fire is really not great. But... Because I kind of have to do it. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Can we just please not get damaged every single time? There's also brown over here. And I'm gonna go and hit them as well. And that unit. Uh, were those guys? Hmm. I'm not gonna move any further because that will get me in direct range of these guys. Um, really only going after the weaker units here. Okay, fair enough. Hmm. I'm certainly not moving into that hex. You cannot move there either. So... We know this is only a roadblock unit. Intercept fire. From what do they get intercept fire? Hmm. 
One of the things that I find unfortunate is indeed that I don't see this unit. And like even with all of those things. I mean, in a sense, it's a bit unfair that I already know now what's there. But the game crashed, so it's not my fault. In a certain way, either. Um... I'm not too comfortable with having only the fleck all the way up front. I thought this gave okay, five points. Hmm. Now, let's move you here. You know what? I I'm just, I'm just gonna go for it and. I'm not afraid. Oh, that's not oh, crap. Let's just do it like this. If only I'd moved them right the first time. But, um. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I need to get control of, of this here, row junction. Uh, in a certain sense. I mean, everything goes through open, open, and of course, I had to fall back there. I don't think that's a good idea because these guys are just coming and attack. It looks nice, but I don't actually think it is. You actually did attack, okay. And that means I'm gonna go down. So let's. First, whip out the old recon for this unit. That very very likely does not get me to see those right now it does Seems like I was still pretty tough. I know they have only tanks. Uh, 
play this too. I think it gives them some too, yeah. How much of an encirclement is it? Well, not even all that much. I got these guys and these two if they don't break out, which they very well might. And I have another problem, which is that this hex is open. Um... But I'm going to put both of these there too, in the hopes of me also then getting that kind of uh, counter battery fire. Now, I also want to move. These up. You're moving back out there. If I can get a few of the units to move towards this road, like in reality, I, I need the main road. Like having this one tiny thing there is not going to help me. My god, those are poor attacks. The only thing I can do now, for now, is hold out. I might even say I, I kind of need to pull back here. Because I cannot hold that, unfortunately. The fact that they have new units there, especially in the form of, I guess, 1st and 9th Infantry Division. Means uh, I cannot move in there now. This might be overcomable in the next turn, depending on how that ultimately looks. This is the depot, right? It's completely depleted of supplies as it is. Let's add some fuel, I'll leave it on empty. Mm. Yeah, I mean, they can blast away. There, there's. No reason why I would care about that.
Do I have any cards to use? Where's the first here? No cards. That means that most of the units here are going to escape because there's no way I can take this now. Um, yeah. Perhaps on a night attack, but I don't really see it happening. Okay, it's uh, it's something, I suppose. Um, not super useful, but it's something. Just like I at least took Laglaise and Stumont, they're not particularly uh, important places but technically the only thing I need to do now is um, hold my points in a way See, that didn't go... Oh, they did capitulate, though. Hmm. Okay, so it wasn't that bad. It doesn't make me go in there. Oh, what were those guys? Whoops. Well... <laughs> Messed that one up, did I? Didn't I? Not just a little bit. I don't think this is anything super important either. But apparently I cannot see it. I can move my little units around, but That doesn't magically help me. Hmm. 
these guys though I'll just move them forward can't keep them exposed Let's see, because if I can get units further along, I will. <laughs> There's a lot of units out there now. I don't think I can put anything in there. But um, I don't mind getting access to this road forever it will be worth. This is now cleared. I will be looking to split these units a little bit, but I'm going to have to see how that's going to work out ultimately. Um, my units are holding that in some form. Rest of these guys definitely staying in their positions there. This is not ideal, but I kind of want to hold those guys there. Keep it like that. But those um, AA units can move quite a bit, which is pretty nice. So indeed, it wasn't actually everything there. Uh, 
kind of curious what this unit of the 84th will do. I guess they have the entire division there, or the rest of that entire division. It must be new as well. But I feel like I have most units of the 101st under control now, except for this. Um, so I'll have to find a way to, to do that. There we go. Next turn. Very curious what it will bring actually, uh, especially given that it will be a night turn as well. The um, AI certainly got a lot of reinforcements. Well, we'll have more to come, but that's kind of, I guess, the difficulty of this game. I mean, in a sense, you're playing also the retreat. So even though initially you're making good advances, we're going to have to retreat from quite a few places too and hope that we can hold on to a 200 in order to get the decisive victory in a sense. Uh, seems like this is fixed now. Lost a few units there. Um, if there's no attack, I will not pause, I guess. I'm, I'm really trying not to pause so I can keep that kind of stuff going. Uh, it doesn't even want me to pause, okay. Seems like these guys are going up. I, I like that. I'd rather have that than that they attack there. The weird thing is that they're kind of like shuffling into the middle now, and I don't really have a whole lot of clue why they would be doing that. Ultimately, I'm looking to grab as many enemy forces from this as I can, no matter how many it is, really. So, if we, um, let's just go up all the way to the north. So. What I'm looking for here in this area is pretty much just whittling down the enemy over time because I don't have such a numerical advantage that I can really uh, make use of it. So I kind of have to take any form of destruction of enemy forces I can get. Um, because if I can ultimately dig in around this city and have some form of defense around these woods or something similar, even if I don't take Eupen and or Vervier, it still is a significant improvement from the historical outcome, which is good. They attack with their tanks in there, but we held. And then here, this is encircled units.
Air two. He's just trying to get it into the glisse. Didn't make it. And trying to get out. Um, now these units are also trapped. They're part of the 101st trying to get out here towards the wrong way. They were trying out for a breakout in the wrong direction. I would say, but this was in the right direction. I lost a lot of Panzer Grenadiers there too. Pretty rough attack at that. All right, finally this time, this time these guys didn't rout my units. Those damn tanks. Um, I just stood an orthodox encirclement here. Have to be careful about that too. Now, if they are using artillery here, we know that this is not that much then for now. Interestingly, these units now looking for a breakout as well. Seems like they got one more unit, even though they're still mostly colliders and a bunch of M10s. Again, we held at least, losing a panther and a whirlwind. Fine. Still don't like this. They might get at me from the back. Oh, oh boy. Yeah. Well, that was certainly a danger. Um, nope. So I'll try to get those guys back in our retreat. Hmm. Yeah, sure, please just go in there. That that would be the best for me. Ideally, they'll leave this relatively undefended, so I can take that, but... That's near Champlain. Like, even if they defend there, that's not a problem to me. Should have put that supply on empty, uh, but I didn't. My mistake. Okay, 214 points. We've got another Felder Sats, which is nice. I don't 
think the game just automatically deploys any units like uh, as it will say like oh you got this unit i don't think it does that Everything went to units, everything went to fuel. It is out of everything. Bit of a disaster that. What's not a disaster is that at least I made it up in here. And that's pretty good. Um, right, I think though what I'm gonna do for now is I'm gonna end the video here because I see that my time is up. I wanna thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider leaving a like, comment, or subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. If you want to see more episodes, then uh, head down to patreon.com and, you know, see if uh, supporting me in any way uh, suits your fancy. Anyway, take care. See you next time. Bye-bye.